everybody. I'm going to show you one of my favorite keyboard shortcuts. Uh, it really uh, saves a lot of time when you're coloring. And uh, basically what it is is uh, holding down the Alt or Option key while you have your brush tool selected. So I begin rendering her hair by using uh, a large airbrush for the top of it. Uh, and then I'll pick different brushes that are more shaped like her hair shapes to kind of pick out different uh, areas to highlight. And using that Alt or Option key while I do this just kind of speeds things up because you're able to pick colors around uh, where you're working. In this case, I'm able to pick the base color if I want to and kind of blend that in with the highlights that I'm doing or um, I can pick a darker color and do the same thing. So I kind of use this as a rendering technique to just keep going back and forth, back and forth between the highlight, the base color, and the shadows. So occasionally I'll actually open uh, the color picker window, which just allows me to pick different uh, variants of the same color family as I go as well. Uh, and in this case, I don't really do it much. I only do it to uh, find a lighter version of her hair color and a darker version of her hair color. You can get to that menu by clicking on your foreground color, which is located on your toolbar. So thanks a lot guys, I appreciate all the feedback I got from the first episode and hopefully this uh, kind of helps you guys with some other questions you may have had. I'm going to keep these coming so just keep emailing me and letting me know uh, what you want to see and um, I'll talk to you next time.